guys. Beautiful day outside today. So, so I'm going to work out here in the garage with the door open and uh, show you my little setup here. Pretty, uh, pretty ghetto, but it works. Squat back here. Got some weights. I'll set this up for the bench. Kids outside playing. Say hi. Lately I've been spending all of my time up inside of my mind Looking for clues and to see what I'd find I figured the answers were somewhere and hidden And all that I needed to do was rewind on myself and go try to reflect I'm searching for reasons why I haven't left And the only thing I ever felt he was stressed Even when I was killing shit, giving my best My homies took off to the west and I'm kinda depressed I chose to keep working so I could invest Everything that I have in this dream And it seems that I'm finally starting to feel the effects All us together on different quests My friends and my family love them to death I made sure I was flexible so I ain't stressing you people who telling me this is a stretch I done been through it all, man, wars in my head Thinking that I'm better dead, I get panic attacks Every time I'm asleep, I've been waking up screaming and covered in sweat Anxiety's killing me, made me depressed But it's one thing I look at, it's something to test me To see if I wanted to see how I'll get it So I'm never sweating the days I don't rest Which is every 
every night I've been working, every night I've been slaving, every night I've been hurting, so every night I'm creating and crafting up something you'll think is amazing, this is for people who hate it and acted like I don't deserve it, y'all get deserted, I don't perspire it, y'all are the lighter, which fuels all the fire that burns in the furnace, see this is for all of that pain, all of those nights I was going insane, all of those people who brought up the storm, setting up wars every night up inside of my brain, I don't believe anything that you claim, so every night I'm working till I'm drained, I finally found that sunshine through the rain, cause they don't wanna see us win, they don't wanna see us win, man they would rather see us fall, man they would rather see us fall, see people easily forget, see people easily forget, that we done sacrificed it all, that we done sacrificed, oh man, homie what I wouldn't give, homie what I wouldn't give, just to see this shit pay off, just to see this shit pay off, see any obstacle that's sick, see Signs. Anything telling me that it's my time. I've been up in the studio working till five. Just making. Just uh, finished up my my routine for today. The workout called for uh, was well, my squat bench and deadlift. All three. This is the end of my um, the end of my four week training cycle. Well, it's a twelve week cycle, but this was my rep test, which we do on the fourth week. Um, basically it's just 85% of your one rep max that I got calculated or that that I did before starting this program um, throughout this program I've been working with various percentages of my one rep max for different um, sets and reps and things and after three weeks on your fourth week you do a rep test 85% um, squat bench and deadlift the goal here is to get at least five reps with 85% um, in order to move on to the next training block. Um, so I start off with squat, I warmed up with uh, 135 pounds, I believe I did about eight reps to get warmed up and I bumped it up to 185 for six, 225 for four, and uh, then my 85% is calculated at 285 pounds, which I got six reps. I um, was pretty happy about that. Um, the, the thing about that was when I did my max, I was wearing knee sleeves. Well, anyway, I, I didn't have my knee sleeves today, so I just did it raw well, with just a belt, no sleeves, no wraps, or nothing. And uh, those usually. They usually help out quite a bit, so I was pretty pretty happy getting six reps with 285. I probably could have got maybe eight, eight maybe more if I had my sleeves on. Uh, next thing was the bench press. Started off with 135. I kind of progressed a little quicker on this. Um, just kind of wanted to get it get it done with. Uh, Ten reps at 135. Bumped it up to 185 for six or 185 for five excuse me and then my my 85 percent for this is actually 212 pounds but I just went to 215 since I didn't have I don't have one and a quarters or anything to get to that 212 um, just went straight to 215 I actually hit that for eight reps which which is good that means I'm progressing really well um, not to mention that it's three pounds heavier than my 85%, uh, so I'll probably be bumping up for phase two, bumping up my um, my percentages. Probably you re recalculate your one rep max, and based on this, I'll probably add three percent to my one rep max for my bench press, and then the new calculations will be, you know, based off of that added three percent. Um, finally. At the end was the deadlifts. This was pretty tough. I was pretty tired after doing those those rep maxes or am reps, as many reps as possible for squat and bench. I did take pretty good rest periods for this, anywhere from five minutes, sometimes maybe even a little more for that final set. Uh, 
deadlifts I did 10 reps at 135 just to warm up did them fast tried to feel tried to be explosive I bumped it up to 225 for five and then I think I did a couple with 295 and then my 85 percent for this was um, 310 pounds so I put 310 pounds on the bar did as many as I could I believe I got seven reps with 310 so still pretty good um, over that five that I needed to move on and uh, so I was pretty happy with that looking back at the at the form my form could probably be a little bit better uh, hips are shooting up pretty early a little bit of roundness in the low back but not too bad just something I'm gonna have to work on with those lighter weights um, good thing about this starting this YouTube channel and recording my workouts was I mean really when I work out I don't really have a partner or anything so this has actually helped me quite a bit to where I can analyze and see my own form and make adjustments a lot of times it may feel <clears throat> it may feel to you that it's you know your your forms perfect but then when you have it on camera and you look back you can see those you can see those flaws that that uh, you might not necessarily feel when you're doing the exercise so definitely be having more workouts I'll be starting the new new uh, training block continuing with these big three lifts trying to get stronger not really prepping for a meet or anything but I would like to compete um, later on in this year hopefully in a USAPL powerlifting meet um, right now I'm like 170 pounds 169 pounds um, the weight classes I believe that are around my weight would be 163 so I'd either have to you know cut some weight or 181 I believe either I think it's 181 or 183 so I could I could you know gain some weight or bulk up or not really be too worried about my calories and stuff like that but uh, yeah we'll see we'll see what happens I'll uh, keep you guys updated if I do do a do a meet here in the future uh, definitely probably get all my lists recorded and, and post that up too anyways guys appreciate uh, appreciate you guys watching tuning in um, if you have any any questions about my programming or you know maybe how to how to structure <clears throat> how to structure a strength routine or bodybuilding routine during this I'm also doing hypertrophy days upper and lower body where I'm where I'm hitting you know anywhere from 8 to 12 reps and you know still doing accessories you know doing arms buys tries shoulders all that so it's it's a pretty good routine get to mix in the the strength with um, with some hypertrophy work and try to build up size as well so uh, yeah I hope you guys enjoy it thanks for watching and I'll see you next time peace